A dishwasher is a huge time saver when it comes to keeping your kitchen clean. But when it starts to smell or your dishes aren't coming out sparkling, it can honestly feel more like a hassle. If you're having these common dishwasher issues, you're in the right place. Today, I'm going to show you how to clean your machine from the inside out. The drain filter is not only the most likely culprit contributing to strange smells coming from your dishwasher, but it's also probably why your dishes aren't coming out clean. To start tackling this problem, start here. Take out the bottom rack and use a damp cloth or paper towel to start removing any debris from the bottom of your dishwasher. Remove your filter and be sure to wash it with some warm soapy water. Don't forget to get inside. You may want to use a bottle brush to make sure you get all of the debris out. Now, removing your own filter will really depend on the model of your own dishwasher, so you may want to consult your owner's manual if you're having any trouble. And repeat this step every three months to make sure that you keep your dishwasher fresh and clean. Before putting your filter back in your dishwasher, make sure the drain isn't clogged. You can use a cable auger if you have one. Once you've reinstalled the drain filter, take a warm soapy rag and clean the entire interior of your dishwasher. You can even use Kitchen Safe Household Cleaner for those extra tough spots. Wash the door gasket. It can accumulate moisture and grime, which can contribute to the unpleasant smells. Even though your racks are an unlikely cause of any smell, take them out and give them a nice scrub in the sink so that way you cover all of your bases. You'll also want to take out your dishwasher sprayer arm. Make sure to get all of the food particles out from all of the holes. You can use a handy tool like a toothpick to help you do this. Baking soda and vinegar are two natural odor eliminators that you can use in several ways to clean your dishwasher. You can also use bleach for tougher odor culprits such as mold, but just remember it is extremely dangerous to mix bleach with vinegar. Place one cup of distilled white vinegar on the top rack of your dishwasher. If you do this, make sure your dishwasher is empty. You can also add a few drops of essential oils if you don't like the smell of vinegar, and then just run your dishwasher on a normal setting. Follow up your vinegar shower by sprinkling the bottom of your dishwasher with a cup of baking soda. Run it on the shortest setting, but also the hottest so you ensure that the baking soda dissolves completely. To rule out the possibility of a clogged drain, take one tablespoon of baking soda and two tablespoons of vinegar and pour it into the drain. Let it sit for about 15 minutes and then run your dishwasher on a normal cycle. Green, brown, or black spots are signs of mold and should be treated with bleach instead of baking soda and vinegar. Just keep in mind, you shouldn't use bleach if you have a stainless steel dishwasher, and you should only use one cup at a time. You should run your dishwasher on a hot setting so it dilutes the bleach and doesn't damage the interior. In order to not make any toxic chlorine gas by mixing chemicals, also plan to run your machine before and after using bleach. Keep things fresh by washing your filter every three months. Make sure to scrape off all the food that you can off your dishes before you load them into the dishwasher. And also fill it before each use. If you found this video helpful, leave us a comment below and let us know what tips you want to see from us next.